Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Display Note Broadcast Chrome extension to broadcast your screen to your students' computer screens. Let's go ahead and take a look at this. So you can see it's a Chrome extension. There's also an option to use it without the Chrome extension, and I wrote about that back in April. Now, let's go ahead and use this Chrome extension to, let's say, broadcast this particular tab. And to do that, you can see I have the extension installed in the upper right corner, and I'm going to start a broadcast. And when I do so, it's going to ask me to decide what I want to share. I'm going to share a Chrome tab, and I'm going to share just that particular tab. And now let's share it. And you can see here, it's now saying, hey, you're sharing your screen. You can stop it at any time. But you probably want to know, how do your students get to see the screen? So to do that, let's take a look over here at this other tab. And we'll see that there is a link with a code for students to enter on their screens in order to view the screen right here. And I should point out that once you have the screen broadcast, you still have some options down here to change out the broadcast. You can even capture this particular screen and say, I want to capture this Chrome tab, and then I want to draw on it, or I just want to ca capture it as is, and then I can stop sharing that screen. And let's go back over here, and you can see here we also have this copy of the code, and there's just the simple copy, and take a look over here, and you'll see there's an integration to link with Google Classroom, and so you can shortcut the process of students having to enter a code by instead putting that link into your Google Classroom. And then when you're done, just hit stop sharing and you are done sharing your screen. So that's a short overview of the broadcast extension from Display Note. Give it a try this fall. I think you'll like it. As always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.